Good morning. I'm Helen from Georgia, and I'm out here this morning, early this morning, with the birds uh, flying around and eating, and the butterflies, and uh, uh, it's a beautiful morning. And I'm going to start a new project today. It's going to be some draped flower pots. It's going, it's going to be a different way. I, I'm trying something a little different. So. I'm going to mix up my cement now and show y'all how show you how that's done and hopefully it turns out good. And thank y'all so much for watching this video. Have a blessed day. Subscribe and share. Thank you. And be kind to each other. <laughs> thank y'all so much. Okay, this is my Georgia sand. Ten cups. Here's ten more cups of Georgia sand. And ten cups of Portland cement. Mix it up. It as you can mix it, stir it. water and it's going to take a good bit of water today because I'm going to dip my uh, my little cloths in this stuff so it's going to take a good bit of water today and it has to be kind of thin to do that see that it's still not enough water. It doesn't, I don't think it needs any more water. set up my, get my little blanket things that I'm going to use. Okay. This is my cloth that This is my cloth that I, and it's really not in a round circle, it's just cutting. Just an oblong little shape. Okay, I'm dipping it in this.
I'm going to let this be absorbing the liquid in here. And I'm going to try to show you my... I'm going to have to take my gloves off, one of them. Okay, I, I set it up on this little piece of pipe that I had, and I bought this little basket at Salvation Army for 99 cents, I think it was, and I'm going to put a piece of plastic over it to uh, preserve the basket, because I'm probably going to use it later. Put this over the top of it. I'm getting this other one saturated. Cement where it will hold its shape. Putting this around here to hold it out just a little. I'm not wanting it to hold out a lot. I just want it to stand out just a little.
Okay, I'm going to take this around there and let it dry. Okay, getting ready for my other one now.
Okay, I'm going to uh, take this around there and let it dry. See how it turns out. <laughs> Good morning. I'm Helen from Georgia, and I'm out here this morning opening up my project that I started a few days ago. And when I was uh, viewing my uh, videos, I noticed that my camera had cut off on one little part that, that I put these little doily things that I got from the Dollar Tree I dipped them in my cement mixture and I put them on my flower pot but it didn't show that because it shows them on there but it didn't show me putting them because my camera cut off and I didn't realize it but I wanted to let you know what happened I'm going to paint my I'm going to take them out of the molds and I'm going to paint them and I hope you like them and thank y'all so much for watching these videos. Have a blessed day. Subscribe and share. Thank you so much. Okay, there's my pot that I'm going to take out of the mold now and let you see how it looks. And it's good and hard. It's Here's what it looks like. I put a basket in here and I'm going to take the basket out. Okay, got the basket out. It's in good shape. <laughs> now the plastic. Now the can full that I stuck in here. Getting off little strings that was sticking up. Okay. Okay. okay, that's how it looks. Okay, I'm going to set it up on something where I paint it better. Okay, I hope it don't fall off.
Okay, I'm I'm gonna set this over here and let it dry. It's almost already dry. Okay, here's here's my other one. As you know, I pinned up the side so it would have a little drape to it. I'm going to try to cut these pins out. <laughs> my pins See if I can get this basket out without tearing it up. Okay, I got it out. Okay, that looks great. This is my finished draped flower pots. They're beautiful. They're heavy. Thank y'all so much.